about to show you not only that this is real, but how this is real and how it's being used right now and where they're going to take it. We got to start with the science of Wi-Fi, what it is and how it moves through space. At its most basic, Wi-Fi is electromagnetic radiation that we use to carry data. It's on the same spectrum as radio waves, visible light, x-rays, etc. It's actually here in the microwave band, between radio waves and infrared. What well, that will cause is like a donut of radiation spreading outwards. Graduate students have developed software that uses Wi-Fi signals to recognize silhouettes behind walls. Say the signal hits a wood door. At the boundary, some waves are reflected back, some refract in, a few could scatter across tiny variations in the wood grain, or diffract around the edge of the door. Some waves that make it inside the wood might be absorbed by the wood's atoms. Others reach the far side, but get reflected back in. This is a device that basically um, tracks people through wireless signals. Uh, it can do so in a variety of ways, from motion to identifying who a person is based on the shape of their skeleton, as well as um, measuring their breathing and heart rate. Can you hold your breath? Okay, he inhaled a lot, so it went up, yeah, it's and then constant. it's constant, you see? So, which means because she's not holding her breath, and her heart rate is pretty high. I think she had already two to really get the sense of the combinatorics of this, how about, can we go from Wi-Fi radio signals, you know, sort of like the Wi-Fi routers in your house, they're bouncing off radio signals that work sort of like sonar, can you go from that to where human beings are, to images? So what they did is they had, um, you know, a camera looking at a space with people in it, um, that's sort of like coming in from one eye. The other eye is the radio signals, so sonar from the uh, Wi-Fi router. And they just learn to predict like, this is where the human beings are. Then they took away the camera. So all the AI had was the language of radio signals bouncing around a room. And this is what they're able to reconstruct. Real time, 3D pose estimation, right? So suddenly AI has turned every Wi-Fi router into a camera that can work in the dark, specially tuned for tracking living beings. Social media post claims that Hitachi has made a new chip called Smart Dust that, if consumed, can track a person with its GPS capability. An internet search about Hitachi product Smart Dust led us to a 2007 news article about a similar chip. According to the article, Hitachi displayed an RFID chip that measures 0.002 inches by 0.002 inches, which looks like bits of powder or specks of dust. However, there was no mention of these having GPS capabilities, or of these being able to functionally be injected or absorbed into the human body. Hitachi disclosed this information about this RFID chip in a February 2006 news release. Hitachi earlier developed a tiny new RFID with an embedded antenna microchip and unveiled it in a news release in 2003. According to Hitachi, these chips can be used in securities, identification, preventing counterfeiting and tracing ingredients. Sidewalk is a shared network that allows connected devices to continue working amidst disruptions and with longer ranges. This technology is now available for developers to integrate into devices and accessories, opening the door to new solutions and innovations the world has never seen. Sidewalk is a network by the people, for the people, made safe by the latest in internet security technology. So what does that mean and how does it work? Amazon Sidewalk uses a variety of wireless technologies, one of which is LoRa. LoRa is a low-power, long-range solution that allows any sidewalk device within range to maintain a network connection. Select devices serving as bridges pool together a tiny portion of internet bandwidth to create one expansive network. Why is that useful? Say you're out of town and you want to remotely turn on your outdoor lights. If your home network connection is lost, so is that communication. But with Amazon Sidewalk, your lights still receive that message using the shared Sidewalk network. Additionally, if you drop your keys on your morning run, Sidewalk can alert you of their approximate location. It can also detect motion, track packages, sense air quality and water leaks, monitor security, 
the possibilities are truly endless. With Amazon now opening up Sidewalk to developers, expect to see a growing number of tech aimed at making the world a safer, smarter, and more connected planet.